So here's a quick video going online with my Amiga 2000 and the new XSurf 100 network card. I've also got installed in here a uh, GVP GeForce 040, a Picasso 2, uh, an extra 8 megabytes of fast RAM, and a 8516 sound card, MechWare card reader, 8 gig CF, yada yada, all that good stuff. <coughs> So I just got this installed and I still need to uh, make some of my icons a little prettier, but interface, we'll go online. I'm sure there's a faster way to do this. I can't remember what the trick is with Miami. It's been 12 years or whatever since I used it uh, to make it go online automatically, but in any case. Go ahead and let's see. I started messing around with the interface a little bit to try to make it more like I liked it. So you can see Google comes up pretty fast. Um, pretty awful image for today. Uh, actually, I think it's International Women's Day or something I saw before. Um, should find out how to get eyebrows running on its own separate screen. That might improve the palette a bit. Also, I think my workbench is running in. Uh, what is my workbench running in? Oh, well, there you go. 65,000 colors. Not too bad. I also have uh, Super Plus. I have an Indivision ECS in here. <coughs> Anyhow, um, I thought this was pretty neat. I loaded this earlier. Um, Google News. This is going to pull a whole lot of data, and you'll be able to see how quickly the uh, XSurf 100 transfers. I'm connected to my office network, uh, which is just a 50, 5010 uh, Comcast cable modem. And we also have a fiber line as backup, but this time of night everything just runs over the cable modem. <clears throat> so it looks like it's done already. What did it? What did it load? Five hundred and something k. You can see here's. It's still formatting some images. With this much data, I'm more worried about running out of memory than anything else. But we can do, uh, let's, let's hit that and search AmyNet for, I don't know, eyebrows. Show you guys how fast it transfers. There you go, it's done. So, quite usable as far as just going on to AmyNet and uh, downloading files. Of course, my first, first bookmark that I created was Amiga.org. And this is a pretty Data intensive pages seem to have a lot of JavaScript. <clears throat> sure, there's additional optimizations I can do with this. I think this is the number of connections it's down, it's made at a time.
seems to be the big hang up is that processing JavaScript stuff. Formatting could be better, but still. I'm not sure if my little phone is focusing on this very well. There we go, now it's focusing a little better. But here you go. Again, a little ugly, quite usable, however. So, uh, where's my thread at? Oh, I uh, wonder if I could open an eBay page. Here's my thread. Let's just click on it and give you guys something to look at. This JavaScript that seems to hold it, hold it, hold back its performance. But again, what was that? Five, ten seconds. Not a long time. I'm sure if I had an 060 or a uh, faster Amiga, uh, 3000 or 4000, something on the Zorro bus, a Zorro 3 bus, this would be even faster. tried to open my bank's website earlier and that uh, immediately bombed out. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't like uh, eyebrows. Um, try eBay. a little better there we go you can see the uh, amount of data that it's transferring and the amount still to go and you can see how fast that's moving along there and this is on just the good old Zora 2 bus I don't actually know if eBay will work I hadn't tried it Probably not. I'm sure that uses all kinds of JavaScript and everything else. And in any case, um, let's go ahead and end this video. I hope you found it helpful and have a great night.